There is a joy that can't be told. It can't be explained. It can only be experienced. It's joy unspeakable. There is a joy that you can't describe. There's a joy that you can't explain. It's not based on our circumstances. It is the gift of God. It is the joy of the Lord. So I want to say to you, Church of the Living God today, if you can't say it, don't be ashamed to spray it. Now, I don't mean spit. I'm not encouraging anybody to spit when they get happy. That's not what I'm saying at all. I'm basically saying, let it out. If you can't explain it, don't try to contain it. Because David found a joy that was so real that he began to take off his outer garments and dance before the Lord in his inner tunic, which we might call his underwear. I wouldn't encourage you to dance before the Lord in here in your underwear. But I'm not going to criticize somebody who has tasted a water from a well that they don't know how to contain. I don't want to contain it. I don't want to cap it up. I don't want to silence my praise. Come on now. I've got to let it out. I've got to praise, got to praise, got to praise, and I've got to let it out. Why wouldn't you want to praise him? I want to see people that God can use and step into you and use you for his glory. And until we get to that place, I want to see you experiencing a joy that is unspeakable and full of glory. So within reason, you don't have to worry about me stopping your praise. In fact, I'm going to be the one up here with, as a cheerleader trying to get you to praise him more. Because that is how you find a place of trust and confidence in him. There is a joy that can't be told. It can't be explained. It can only be experienced. It finds a way of expression. You may not understand somebody waving a flag. You may not understand somebody waving their arms like, a, like waving an airplane into its slot. You, you may not understand somebody trembling like this in the presence of the Lord. You may be like those who come and said, I don't know why they're all crying. You may wonder why somebody's laughing right in church. All these things may feel foreign to you. But I want to tell you there's a joy that's unspeakable but full of glory. You know what glory is? It's the atmosphere of heaven. Fill this house with the atmosphere of heaven. 